everybody welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Naomi Amber and if you're new what's good what's popping it's lit around here if you didn't already know first is this the first video of the new year oh my god first video of the new year lots to come I'm really banking on this year I don't know about y'all but I've invested a lot of time energy and money into making this year the best year yet okay so lots of content coming so be sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out also make sure to follow me on my socials on my tiktok on my instagram my tiktok is growing love that for me my instagram is still in the same place so today we're gonna be doing something real easy real quick real simple one of y'all's faves we're gonna be doing a pretty little thing haul with some winter outfit ideas and also just some winter essentials just some pickups that i wanted to get so i can just have a full and complete closet of essentials but before we get into the fits dossier did send me a new item that they are now selling on their website which are their new candles and they are inspired by some of the scents that they have online so i got to choose one of their new candle scents and i'm so excited to share with you guys and try it out and see how it burns see what it's giving here is the candle here's the box that it comes in and love at first match how freaking cute is that and here is the back very similar um descriptions like with the perfumes um but this one is inspired by the dior sauvage perfume it's more of a, like a manly scent but i like manly musk candles for a candle yes these feel like a nice warm hug so i'm so glad that i got this here's what the candle looks like very similar to their packaging for their perfumes but yeah it's just in a candle form and i think it's so cute clean 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 and musky if that makes any sense like it's like when a man is getting ready he just got out the shower and then he starts you know putting all his layers of fragrance on his lotion his perfume this is what it smells like if you if you like manly musky candles this is really the one for you and it's the one for me because i'm gonna be lighting this today Whew. And they also were kind enough to send me a perfume as well. So I got um, Ambery Vanilla, which is kind of similar to the YSL Black Opium perfume, which I do have. And the top notes are Mandarin, Pear, Pink Pepper, Licorice, Middle Notes, Jasmine, and Orange Blossom, and Base Notes, Cedarwood, Patchouli, Vanilla, and Coffee. And it's the same great quality at a lower price, because I know the YSL is not everybody's price point. Not everyone can spend upwards of $100 on a perfume, so this is a great choice to go with if you want to smell like YSL but not break your bank. Do not forget to use my promo code 10 me for some money off and get to try out Dossier's new candle. Note that Dossier also has free returns and exchanges forever so you can return and exchange things that you know may not be the best fit for you and you want to try something else out that is right. And you can also use my promo code 10 Naomi, which can be combined with their 20% welcome offer on the site. So that's up to 30% off. She also donates all the return perfume bottles to a charity association. And they're trying to stay away from using plastic, so they gave up the 2 milliliter samples. But as I said before, all orders are always risk-free and returnable with or without the sample. You can test out the full-size bottles and ship it back to Dossier if you don't absolutely love it. And above all, all the perfumes are vegan and cruelty-free with clean ingredients and never tested on animals so let's stop chatting let's get right into these fits so first things first we just have this top it's just this black um mock neck crop top i did think it was going to be a little less crop but that's okay that's fine that's fine like i i ain't scared to show a little skin okay i just paired it with some leggings this is a real calm outfit like these some leggings and this pretty little thin cardigan that i just draped over my shoulders to give it more of a chic look i don't know nevertheless this is the top and i wouldn't say it's the softest or most comfortable material but we move it's cool if you are a stranger to my channel you may not notice but if you are an og you know that if i like something in one color i gotta get it in another color so it's literally the same top in white um i do not have any mock neck white shirts and if you've been watching my other hauls you know that it's something that is a staple of a lot of my outfits or my outfit inspiration ideas and i didn't have one so finally 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 i have one and thank the lord i have such a great idea for this i did get this green blazer from zara a while back and i had a per i had the perfect idea to pair this with this white top and then also 
to pair it with these leather shorts. Now, when I was in Zara, I tried to get their shorts, their leather shorts, but they were too big for me, and they were also like $50. And these, I think, were probably like $20. We're not in short season right now, so it's a perfect time to snag these up. But nevertheless, these are the shorts, and if I wanted to wear them during the winter, I'll just pair them with some tights. But here's the shorts, and I plan to pair this with my green Adidas, my Stan Smith Adidas. So I'm really excited for this. I'm so glad I got some leather shorts. They look like they're going to fit my waist really well. I do think that the pants flare a little bit towards the legs i don't know how i feel about that yet but we're just gonna have to see next things next we just have this sweater top and it does do like a little dip like a little fringe dip here you know it's something about a basic that just has a little bit of edge a little bit of a you know a little bit of pizzazz to it that really just calls out to me when i'm shopping on these websites but it's just a regular regular cream ribbed um sweater and like i said it does that little dip at the bottom and i feel like i could pair this with something that that's a little bit more grungy like some green cargo pants some black cargo pants so let me show you guys my options i have these cargo pants that i actually have yet to really wear um from fashion over that i think would look nice with that sweater i also have these khaki pants that i got from the crip that i also think will look really nice with it and just some white shoes and just some white sneakers that will really tie the whole look together it's a really calm outfit the top does most of the talking so I'm not mad at it. Okay, so the next item I got is a little bit out of my comfort zone, but I don't know. Something about it just told me to get it when I was on the website. So it's just this navy blue, this royalish blue kind of jumpsuit. It doesn't have any sleeves. I'm not really too sure. Maybe I could play it with just like a black coat or maybe like a lighter coat, like maybe like a cream coat and then some cream boots or some black boots. But um, I'm really excited for this. It does look a little bit big and long towards like the crotch area so hopefully it fits well i know i'm tall so i don't think i should worry about it too much but it doesn't look like it's gonna snug fit but we are just gonna have to see doesn't matter because i'll probably be wearing it with boots anyway because i do think that the bottoms may not fit but um nevertheless we're gonna see how it looks in a try on portion but i'm excited for this and excited to have like a different piece in my wardrobe and a little bit of color because y'all know i love black and white I did also get this um, Skims dupe lounge set from um, PLT. I feel like I already have this in my closet, but I think maybe there was a mix up with the colors, so that's probably why I bought it again. But I just got this white um, lounge short. This is what it looks like, very Skims-esque. It does look a little bit big. I have these in black in a smaller size, and they like squeeze the circulation out of me. So I don't know, I went up a size, and now I feel like it's not gonna fit at all. And then the top is just this um, white bralette. And for these, I do size up one because they can be a little too small for the boob area. So here's another wardrobe essential, a long sleeve white crop top. I have a black one and I do not have a white one. And I did purchase a white one from Pretty Little Thing a while back, but it was too small. So I was like, you know, let me just go ahead and get a bigger size. It is a slinky material. I don't really care for slinky material, but I need a um white crop top like bad i need a long sleeve white crop top bed and it's either like this or cotton and then cotton is just see-through and then it's ribbed and i don't like ribbed because it's too casual like you, you see my issues here you see where the conflict arises so i just went ahead and got, got the slinky material um hopefully it fits nice um but we're just gonna have to see in the try portion the next thing that i got is just something that's a little bit different and i like this a lot because you can still wear it during the winter because it's super super warm um but it's not an actual coat but it's just this borg um jean black jean jacket it is cropped um so beware of that yeah i don't know how much i paid for this but the quality is amazing it is borg line so the fleece is all lined inside even in the arms so you're definitely going to be warm so you don't have to worry about that and i just plan to pair this with some with a black jumpsuit real calm outfit i just got some chestnut uggs finally added that winter staple to my collection um chestnut uggs for christmas and then my chestnut brown tuffar bag i think that's gonna bang so if you don't get anything out this haul get this it's so comfortable it's so warm like please quality so this next item is also going to be featured in one of my upcoming videos it's going to be in my brown outfit idea video so be on the lookout for that but basically i just got this brown corset and i plan to pair it with some black flare jeans um my black leather trench coat that i got from plt and also just um my black and white nikes so hopefully this fits i do feel like i used to have a corset like this and it didn't fit 
and I gave it away. I don't remember, but I need this for the outfit idea video. And hopefully it comes out nice. We shall see. But yeah, it's just this corset. It doesn't have any like um, support in the boobs, but you can't adjust the straps. And then in the back, there is a zip. So yeah. These next two items, I'm so excited to show you guys. It's a pink set and here is the bodysuit. So it just this pretty little thing on the front and it is short sleeved. I did get this in a medium because I did get this set before in green and um the shirt was way too tight but the the sizing was like two four six whatever but this one was small medium large so i guess i could have gotten a small but i was too scared like i was like no i want this to fit and when you put these in the dryer you can kiss the size goodbye it's gonna shrink so i went ahead and got myself a medium and if it shrinks then it'll shrink right to the size that i need it to be so here's what the medium looks like i'm sure it's gonna fit me divine we'll see we'll see we'll see okay <laughs> and um yeah it's just a bodysuit here and then here are the sweatpants i do size down on the sweatpants because i do like my sweatpants to fit um a bit on the tighter side i am skinny like i do not have enough to be filling in sweatpants and if i go a little bit oversized i'm gonna look like a hobo so <laughs> i just went ahead and got myself the smallest size i think yeah i got an extra small on these and i I love these I have the green ones and you can really match this with anything you can probably match this with the white top that I just showed you guys um any of the white tops that I showed you guys you can match this with a black top and some black shoes like these sweatpants are so versatile you probably wear like a white hoodie if you wanted to like I don't know like the opportunities are endless with this so I'm really glad I got these I really find a lot of use for this and the other one the other sweatpants that I got so yeah. The next item is just this ribbed white dress. Super freaking cute. It does have like this v-neck here and then also does have a slit um, on the legs but it's really ribbed and it's very very warm. I don't care what weather it is. I'm gonna wear a dress as long as you know like ribbed and warm. So it's cool. And I was planning to pair this with my black comb de garçons with you know the little red heart to add just a pop of color. A red bag. Maybe like a black um jean jacket or black crop jacket so i'm really excited for this you guys are gonna see how i styled it on the side yeah but yeah that completes the end of this haul thank you guys so much for sticking around to the end don't forget to like this video if you like this video comment down below a piece that you're going to go run and go get now and do not forget to subscribe to my channel for more quality content thank you again dossier for partnering with me for this video and i will see you guys in my next haul